नमस्ते माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू यू एस पब्लिक स्कूल महाराजगंज इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न फूड एंड हेल्थ बाय प्रिय रंजन पांडे ओके माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स वी ऑल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म नीड फूड नो वी ऑल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म नीड फूड टू से विदाउट फूड वी कॉन्ट लिव नदाउट फूड वी कॉन्ट लिव फॉर दैट वी नीड फूड न वी नीड फूड टू ग्रो न वी नीड फूड टू ग्रो एंड टू स्टे हेल्दी इट ऑल्सो गिव्स अस एनर्जी न फॉर थ्री पर्पज वी नीड फूड टू ग्रो टू स्टे हेल्दी and and for energy to do work we eat different kinds of food this is not only suits or tastes but also provides us with different types of nutrients no in our everyday life we use we eat uh, different kinds of food rice pulses wheat no we use this food stuffs we use uh, we eat uh, roti green vegetables fruits meat eggs milk in our everyday meal we use we include all these food items no why we include all these food items no because all the food items that we eat they contain nutrients they contain nutrients okay what is nutrients so what is nutrients the so nutrients are substances present in food that are required for proper growth and development of our body what are nutrients what are nutrients nutrients are substances present in food that are required for proper growth and development of our body nutrients are substances present in food that are required for proper growth and development of our body okay so keep in your mind nutrients are substances okay which type of substances which present in the food okay substances which present in the food for what no they are uh, required for proper growth and development of our body okay so what are they they are carbohydrate proteins fats vitamins and minerals no they are the main nutrients that may be present in different food stuffs okay in our food stuffs which type of nutrients are present carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins and minerals carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins and minerals are the main nutrients that are that may be present in different food stuffs okay my dear students here you can see a healthy eating pyramid no with the help of this pyramid we can understand that proportion of amount of food okay that uh, we should take in our meal so in our meal we can take maximum amount of maximum amount of cereals no these food items can be taken in maximum amount then fruits and vegetables then moderately 
milk, cheese, meat, eggs, fish and uh, it very less. What is? Fat, salt and sugar. Fat means? Fat means oil. Oil. Okay. Fat, salt and sugar we eat less. We should eat less. Milk and dietary products, beans, products and meat, milk and dietary products, beans, uh, products and meat, we should eat uh, moderately. Fruits and vegetables, we should eat more. And uh, bread and cereals, we should eat most. Okay. Okay. So, there are three kinds of food we have observed now for three purpose here already we have seen ki we eat food to grow to stay healthy and to get energy okay so on this basis food can be classified into three groups first energy giving food bodybuilding foods and protective foods okay energy giving foods bodybuilding foods and protective foods okay energy giving food here a balanced diet energy giving food carbohydrates it provides energy proteins help to grow and repair own our tissues means to say bodybuilding food protein is bodybuilding food fats it also provide energy and keep the body warmth now provides energy and warmth and vitamins and minerals they are called protective food why because they they are necessary for proper functioning of our body okay so vitamins and minerals are known as protective foods okay so once again revise it carbohydrate is for carbohydrate is for energy giving food proteins is bodybuilding food fat is also energy giving food and vitamins and minerals are known as protective food okay so carbohydrates provide uh, energy proteins helps to grow and repair own of tissues fats it provide energy and warmth vitamins it is necessary for proper functioning of our body minerals it is also necessary for proper functioning of our body Okay, so my dear students, we need to take all these nutrients in addict amount, no, in proper amount, every, in our everyday meal, we need to take all these kinds of nutrients in addict amount, okay, a diet. A diet means to say your food. A diet which contains all kinds of nutrients in appropriate amount is called a balanced diet. Okay. A diet which contains all kinds of nutrients in appropriate amount is called a balanced diet. Okay. Balanced diet. What is balanced diet? A diet which contains all kinds of nutrients in appropriate amount in appropriate amount we need all these kinds of nutrients in appropriate amount okay so uh, so the diet uh, diet which contains all kinds of nutrients in appropriate amount is called a balanced diet okay a diet which contains all these kinds of um, uh, nutrients in 
appropriate amount is called a balanced diet okay so health now let's learn health health is a state of complete physical and mental well-being for maintaining good health our body needs a balanced diet regular exercise proper rest good personal hygiene clean and hygienic surrounding okay uh, to be stay healthy to stay healthy we need a balanced diet regular exercise proper rest good personal hygiene clean and hygienic surroundings okay what do we need a balanced diet regular exercise proper rest good personal hygiene and clean and surround and clean and hygienic surrounding okay if we do not fulfill these different needs of our body we may fall ill and get diseases okay so you should include all these kinds of nutrients in your own diet and uh, you must fulfill all these criteria you should take a balanced diet you should uh, have regular exercise you should do regular exercise you should take proper rest okay and uh, you should have good and personal hygiene and uh, you you must have clean and hygienic surroundings okay if you fulfill all this criteria you will not fall ill okay otherwise you may fall ill okay and you will you may get uh, so many diseases okay so i hope stay safe okay thanks for watching